morning, Cougars. Please quiet down for morning prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We prepare for the celebration of the birth of our Lord and hold within our hearts the abundance of love that God brings to this world. God of love, during this Advent season, when life is busy and excitement is in the air, we take time to think about the awesome gift of the birth of Jesus. We reflect on the great love you have for us that will be shown through your son, Jesus. May your light reflect the light that resides within each of us, the love that we can bring to this world, and the healing we can offer those who are suffering. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God is good. All, all the, the time. time. And all the time, God, God is, is good. good. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, and the invincible liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Good morning, Cougars. Good morning. Today is Thursday, and TK through second grade have their winter performance tonight. I can't wait for that. I'm actually going to go. I might be going, and it seems like it's going to be an amazing performance. Yeah, and even if you aren't performing, you should definitely come, because they've been working really hard on this. And it's going to be a great way to get you guys even more in the Christmas spirit, because Christmas is right around the corner. Yeah, it's actually in just a week. That's pretty cool. And also, besides that, it's just a regular school day today. Yeah. But it's fine, because regular can be fun. It's going to be a good day. Here's Brian with the birthday. Hey, Cougars. Today we have a birthday. Tell us your name, what you want, and how old you're turning. I'm Noah. I'm 30, 13, and I want money. Money is always the good answer. Now let's dance. Here's Chris Ann with her DIY project. Hey Cougars, today I have my DIY project. Right now we are preparing for Jesus' birthday, which is coming up in only 11 days. This week's project is a cookie jar nativity Christmas set. It is an adorable decoration that reminds us about the true meaning of the special day. The materials you will need are a cookie jar, glitter paper, star punch, a bird nest, wooden beads, tapered corks, silk, glue, a lot of salt, twine, and twigs. The first step is to cut the tapered corks into the heights of Mary, Joseph, and baby Jesus. Next, cover Mary and Joseph's body with twine and silk for the special baby. Attach twigs for the adult's arms and another piece of silk on Mary's head. Next, make Jesus' manger using a miniature bird's nest and adding silk inside is optional. After, assemble the twigs into a house shape and attach them using the twines. Then use your star punch and make some stars out of the glitter paper and attach them to multiple pieces of twine. You can tape them around the rim of the cookie jar. Lastly, fill your jar with plenty of salt and assemble your nativity set. And you have your cute, beautiful decoration. If you would like to make this project, you can visit the letteredcottage.net. Hope you enjoyed this DIY, Sam students. See you next week. Here's Isaiah and Kendra. Have an awesome rest of your day, Cougars. And if you want to enjoy the Advent season, rise, rise up. up.